I don't like, uh, I do, it's weird that I have like kids now, they're getting a little bit older, and I have to censor their media because it's everywhere, which is weird for me. Because when I was a kid, all my parents wanted to do was just be left the fuck alone, you know? But for me, I have to like monitor what they do because I don't want them doing all the TikTok dances and shit, you know? Like, one of my favorite things, for instance, when I was in sixth grade, my favorite song was by the Notorious B.I.G. And it was a song called Me and My Bitch, okay? It's a great song. If you never heard it, opening line to this song, when I first met you, my first thought was a trick. You look so good, I'd suck on your daddy's dick. Wow. In sixth grade, I didn't know what pussy was, but I didn't know if it was good enough to suck a dick for, I'll tell you that. I was unsure. But now I'm raising these two little girls and I'm like, now that I'm a father, I mean, if you want to date my sweet Jane Jane, Steve, are you saying you're not as good as the notorious B.I.G.? <laughs> thank you, thank you. Uh, I had a... <laughs> now, the weirdest part is when I heard that song in sixth grade and then I had to ask my dad, Dad, what was it like uh, sucking grandpa's dick <laughs> to ask for mom's hand in marriage? <laughs> I'm just kidding, now. I mean, I would never, you know, make my fucking daughter's future boyfriend suck my dick. That's ridiculous. <laughs> it's crazy. He'd be called son-in-law if he did, though. Straight up. Uh, I like that. That's good. That's good. <laughs>